Good evening, everyone. My name is Kevin Ross, and I'm the president of Lynn University. I would like to know something. I would like to know, how is your MCC experience going so far? That's what we were hoping for. So this is a brief interlude. I want to congratulate all the award winners, so very deserving. How inspirational are they? I'd like to thank all of our sponsors. Let's hear it for them again. And all of you for believing in us, this germ of an idea to take MCC out of the Northeast and bring it down here to Florida. Thank you for being here. And a special thank you to all of our Lynn students and Lynn turns from the university who've worked so hard to make this happen. Thank you so very much. So our brief interlude here is to tell you about this network at work, because I know you all engage with each other today, but I want to tell you something that is spun out of MCN. It's a bit of an announcement that we have today. So here at Lynn University, um, we believe in being tinkerers. We don't believe that things should just stay in the same model they always are. And uh, we've been sort of educational mavericks for some time. And uh, so Sam, Vagar, as you know, uh, and there's a lot of things called FOS, Friends of Sam. And, and when, when you meet a friend of Sam's, um, you're instant friends as well. So Sam turned to me one day and he said, look, I've got this friend. And he's starting this new university. It's this new amazing university. It's in Boulder, Colorado, and it's called Watson University. And this is Eric Glustrom, the president of Watson University. So he said, I don't know what you guys are going to do together, but you should just know each other. And I said, great, OK. So Lynn University has um, partnered with Apple. And we have created a whole new style of teaching and learning. We believe there's great strengths and differences. So we have actually done away with books on this campus. Because you know what? Textbooks are not necessarily literature. So what we have done is we have, we have used the Apple ecosystem. We have adopted iTunes U as your course management software. We have faculty creating books that are relevant to the courses that we give to students for free. And we supply our students with an iPad so they can learn, saving them up to 50% of their textbook costs that they would have had before. It has transformed the campus. Uh, we have done it here with our students on ground, and we're about to move into an online space, and that's where Watson comes in. Kevin, thank you so much. First off, a huge round of applause for the coolest university president that I know, Kevin Ross. Also the most handsome and charming as well but also Kevin's team here at Lynn. Lynn is on the forefront of where higher education is going. The partnership with Apple, the partnership with MCN, and now the partnership with Watson. Lynn's gonna be a name we're hearing more and more and more of when it comes to how higher education is preparing the next generation to solve the toughest challenges facing our world. Kevin, thank you so much. Thank you. Watson is a new university model designed for a specific type of student that I like to call the relentless optimist. These are members of the next generation who believe with their whole hearts that we can make the future better than, it, better than today and will stop at nothing to achieve their vision and turn their vision into a reality. But Watson also recognizes that a good idea, idealism, optimism mean very little if it doesn't come with great execution. Thus, Watson is like the Olympic training ground for the next generation of change makers. Our training comes from the Transformative Action Institute in the skills of grit, empathy, creativity, resilience, also coalition building for systemic change through social Aikido and even attracting luck to yourself. The people who are our teachers are the experts in their field, including Jerry White, who co-received the Nobel Peace Prize, Tom Chi, who helped invent Google Glass in the Google self-driving car, and Amy Lovins, who's one of Time Magazine's 100 most influential people for his work to reimagine the energy systems of our country and our world. These people come and live on campus while they're teaching their short courses that we call master courses and do one-on-one -on -one mentorship with the scholars to help advance the ideas that they're working on. And finally, the majority of the experience for each scholar at Watson University is what we call the Watson Lab. This is like a co-working space in which students are working on building their ideas side by side 
and we help connect them to funders, partners, and mentors to carry forward what they're doing. Perhaps most importantly, we ask ourselves the deep, important questions. Who are we, why are we doing what, and why are we doing what we're doing? As a result of this rigorous training, we've seen incredible things come out of Watson, including one of our alumni here in the audience today, Brian Interkin, who is the founder of Lion's Thread, and which empowers women in Uganda to make these beautiful bow ties that Kevin, the scholars, and I are wearing this evening. I don't always wear a bow tie, but when I do, I wear a lion's thread. <laughs> Bottom line is Watson works to protect the courage of the scholars who come to us. We're based in Boulder, Colorado, and you see the capes up here. The capes are our symbol, because the most important quality that we need in the next generation of innovators is courage. Courage to break the status quo, courage to break the mold, courage to think differently. Now, it's a pleasure tonight to officially announce a partnership between Lynn and Watson. About 18 months ago, Sam Vagar introduced Kevin and I, in which he said, Kevin is going to be one of the coolest, not only university presidents, but people you will ever have the chance to meet. Kevin and I had a conversation the week before Watson started, stayed in touch, and through a series of conversations, are pleased to announce tonight that we're officially launching a degree track between Watson and Lynn. This is a three-year degree in which scholars can come to Watson in Boulder, be anywhere in the world during the summer times, and come out with a bachelor's of science in entrepreneurship at the end. It's the first of its kind across higher education here in the United States. And it's a pleasure to say that applications are now open for next year's degree track as well as the spring semester at Watson. I'd like to thank Kevin, Greg Cox, Chris Bonaforti, everyone on the Lynn team for making this possible. The most entrepreneurial team I've had the chance to work with. It's absolutely a privilege to be here and to be part of what's making history in higher education. Thank you so much. This is the pioneer class that you have right here. These are the first few, the brave. And uh, we are thrilled to, uh, to welcome you as Lynn, uh, well, ultimately Lynn alumni, as well as Watson alumni. And these new models are emerging all the time, so stay tuned. But none of this would have happened without MCN. Thank you. Thank you. And just to introduce quickly, Justin on the right, Tessa here, Finn, Andy, and Austin, the pioneer classes, as Kevin said, they come to us from Princeton, Georgetown, University of Colorado, and directly from one of the most innovative high schools in the country. Thank you all again.